What's up, Hedgehog Maniacs and Doki Fanacs? Sonic 17 here, back with more Doki Doki Found Love, which is a mod for Doki Doki Loja Club. The last time we saw me play, the club members went to the whole mech group to make cupcakes. Natsuki, according to Monica, was that was a little bit like Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> that was a nice reference, though. But still wondering why Natsuki shouted at MC the way she did. I'm just wondering what's going on there. Let's, but time to see how the next activity is gonna go down. Because it's time to dive in. And let's do it to it! Here we go! Bring! Bring! Ah! I really don't want to get up! I look at my phone! Six in the morning! Still another hour and a half until school starts! I don't see a text from Na a text from Natsuki! Probably asking when we're gonna head to the store! Can't go to the store! You go alone? Wow! She can't tax! Man, I was really excited to go with her. Wonder why she can't come? Hmm. You don't think this has something to do with Natsuki's dad, does it? I played the, I played some new I played some Natsuki mods in the past. Like Exit Music, Original, Redux, My Escape, and Doom by Design. I just wish for once that Natsuki's dad isn't a bad person. With the exception of some of hope, anyway. <sighs> anyway. I type a reply. Yeah, that's fine. I'll see you at the club. I wait for a reply, but it never comes. Oh, man. This is starting to, this is starting to concern me right now. <sighs> you guys know how I am when it comes to Natsuki. Text Sayuri and tell her that I can't walk to school with her today. Alright, guess I should get ready. I quickly shower, throw on my uniform, and head out the door. Back at the convenience store. It's a quick walk to the store. When I enter, it's fairly empty. Too late for the school crowd. Too late for the work crowd. And I grab a box of hot chocolate mix and head to the counter. The cashier was a younger kid. Probably in his early 20s. He looked extremely bored. This isn't the regular store owner I'm used to, so they must have him so they must have hired him recently. Interesting. Will this be all for you? Yep, that should be it. That'll be 300 yen. I hand over a 500 yen bill. Here's your change. Oh, you can. Never mind. Monica, what the hell's going on here? As I'm leaving, I see Monica enter the store, and she doesn't seem to notice me. I see her walk behind an aisle, grab something, and just walk out. What the hell? not like Monica to do something like this. Something's up. Odd. Did Monica just steal from the store? Why did the cashier say anything? Now that you say that, I'm wondering that too. This is not like Monica. There has to be something going on. I'm very confused right now. Well, the cashier doesn't seem to be, be the type of to pay attention. 
Maybe I'll bring it up to her in the club. Good idea. Alright. Off I go! <laughs> Let's hope Monica explains herself. Finally, classes are over. Time to head to the club. <laughs> I enter the room and see that everyone is here but Natsuki and Monica. Natsuki and Monica, the two people I actually need to talk to. I walk over to Sayuri. Have you seen Natsuki or Monica? Yeah, I have glasses with them. They both showed up. As if on cue, they walk in together. Hmm. Very suspicious, if you ask me. Walk over to Monica first to ask her what happened at the store. Hey, Monica, I saw. <laughs> Sayuri! Why are you gonna interrupt? But what did that whole the conversation say? Hey, Monica, I saw you and I saw you at the convenience store. Yeah, yeah, the. Monica turns towards the girls. I guess I have I guess I have to wait to talk to her. For now. What are you talking about? I'm fine. Yeah, the bruise on your face. Bruise? Don't see it, but. Figures. Why did it have to be the same as other mods? <sighs> Just for once, can Natsuki's dad not be the bad guy? Anyway. I have no idea what you're talking about, Sayuri! Did you end up today? You clearly say things that you aren't that aren't there! I don't really have bruised looks like that, Ski. By now, both Monica and Yuri have walked over. Yeah, that's key. You definitely have a bruise. And it looks like you tried to hide it. Yuri points at the failed makeup job hiding the, hiding the bruise. Are you okay, that's key? You can tell us what happened. No! I can't! Come on! We're, we're here for you! Always! Natsuki looks genuinely pissed. This must be very important if she, do, if she wants to protect the secret so badly. Natsuki! If someone or something is hurting you, I'm sure we all, we all like to know so we can help you. The other girls nod. They are clearly concerned. There is nothing you can do to help me! Leave me alone! Oh. Man. I know not to be aggressive at times, but... This is reminding me of what happened in Blue Skies. Why I mentioned that. Anyway, back off a bit. In this state, she definitely won't be telling us anything. The other girls seem to have realized the same thing. Alright, Natsuki, you don't have to tell us, but know that we are here for you. Always. I give her a sincere smile. It seems that relaxed her, but I can tell she's still on edge. Can we just get on with this? Can we just get on with the activity? Yeah, can everyone pick D? I did! There! Yeah. Sayori so pulls out a single peppermint tea bag from her jacket pocket and pulls it, puts it on the table. Is that gonna be enough for all of us?
I'll say Yuri. Sayuri! We all share our favorite team in every way in the club! Oh! Hey, Dad! Uh, Yuri, you brought a team for everyone, right? Yes, I did! Here! Yuri pulls it an ordinary box out of her bag and opens it. Inside are many different tea bags. They're all very sophisticated blends. At least, I think they are. I don't actually know anything about tea. Oh boy. I could've just picked one, so I bought a few different types. Very nice, Yuri. This will make up for Sayuri not bringing it up. Sorry! <laughs> Sayuri. <laughs> what about you, Sayex? What did you bring? Here, I have it in my bag. I look over to Natsuki. He's still looking a bit upset. I pull out the bag of hot chocolate and flash Natsuki a wink. <laughs> oh boy. But I can just imagine how that's gonna go down. Natsuki looks over. She seems to poke up and winks back. I think I would bring something a bit different since we'd be going through a lot of tea. Smart, but not quite the activity. Yeah, sorry. I think I'd do something different. Mago's looking kind of annoyed with everything that just went wrong. Oh boy. <sighs> Why did they get to be under something bad's about to happen? What about you, Natsuki? What did you bring? Um, I didn't have time to buy any. Maga looks like she's about to snap. She just turns around and grabs a box of green tea bags. Well, I bought these. She suddenly poisonously puts them on the table. Uh, I'm gonna go get water for the kettle. Yuri quickly gets herself out of the awkward situation. About five minutes pass. Maga seems to have calmed down. But Yuri isn't back yet. Hey, I'm gonna look. I'm gonna go look for Yuri. She, she's been gone for a while. This doesn't elicit really much of a reaction besides a wave of dismissal from Monica. Yeah, Monica is not too pleased about how everything is going down right now. Anyway, the water fountains are down here. So that's probably where she is. There she is. Hey, you okay? You've been gone for a while. Yuri, Yuri looks quite upset. I should talk to her. Sorry, I just got distracted. What's wrong? You look down. Do I? I'm sorry. Don't apologize for your feelings. You can talk to me. <clears throat> I'm a good listener. Maga seems really upset. I think she's mad at me. Eh, I think she's more mad at me than Natsuki. You probably handled that the best of, out of all of us. Yeah, but this was my idea. So anything that happens is my fault. No, the idea was great. It's just the people that weren't. Are you sure she's not mad at me? I'm positive. Yuri takes a deep breath and walks up the dog to return to the clubroom. Alright, let's head back to the clubroom. Look who I found! Yay! Let's, let's get this started! Yuri heats up the pot and steeps and steep some of Ma Monica's green tea. We all drink our tea while making casual conversation. Most of the club has passed and we all and we're all winding down. We have one drink left. Yui holds up the box of hot chocolate that I bought. Woo! Something sweet to end the day! Yui makes the beverage and gives us gets each of us a cup. We all we all We all, all still make a casual conversation. 
Well, everyone except Ma except for Monica, who was just sipping in silence. As we all finish our cups, we realize the club day is over and start to clean up. This is really bad! Yeah, it was. Thanks, guys. What for? Have a great day. I really didn't think this would be fun, but I really enjoyed it. It really seems that taking light offense to that. You are all, you are such good friends. Is she is she talking about us? Is she, is she talking about us being nice for her earlier? Guess I'll never know. Could be both. I don't know. Anyway, Monica hasn't said a word for quite a while. She still looks pretty upset. An upset Monica scares me than an unstable Yuri. I'm just saying that right now. Monica grabs her bag and leaves the room. Wait, where are you going? And she's gone. Well, not much we can do about it now. Sayuri frowns. It must have been hard for her to let Monica go in such a bad mood. Hey, Monica will be fine. She's pretty tough. Wanna walk home now? Cool. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I wave to Natsuki and Yuri. Bye. Farewell. So you and I leave the club and walk home. Next week. I know this is going to be short, but this is where I'm going to stop, Hedgehog Maniacs. I'm not, not quite what you were expecting as far as the tea thing, but Monica was a little... I can't say I blame Monica for being upset and everything, but I don't know. But there's still unanswered questions. Like, why did she take something from that from the convenience store where MC was there getting the hot chocolate. Doesn't make sense. Hopefully we can find out later on. But for now, Sign X17 signing out. I'll catch you guys in the next video. See you guys later. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and let me know what you think down below. If you want to see more of my content, subscribe to me so you check out the rest of my content and you also check out the videos you see here on the screen. I told you to stop doing that, Monica!